What is up? This is Down Lane. In this episode, we're going to be playing um, uh, Final Fantasy X. We're going to defeat Seymour, which is going to be awesome. Um, and then we uh, will start in the... Uh, I actually forgot what it's called, but we're going to go to the mountain <laughs> area. And uh, we'll start fighting uh, some pretty tough monsters. Not so much more difficult, but they are a little bit more difficult, and we'll have like scenes where we have to use only Titus and um, Riku and Waka because we'll like water scenes and stuff like that. But overall, um, we'll uh, accomplish that and try to capture all the monsters we can, uh, just so that we can get everything ready for. The, uh, final, well, actually, sorry, so we can collect everything from the monster, uh, what is called, like the little monster place, <laughs> monster arena, where you fight, or where you actually, like, get the rewards from, uh, capturing the monsters. Um, so we'll, we'll do that, and then we'll also capture every monster, well, we'll do that at the end. We're, we're only going to capture the monsters really here. Uh, and in the mountain area, and then after that we don't really care about capturing the monsters because the only place that we'll capture after that is the calm lands. Um, and, uh, but anyways, after we leave that one mountain area, what we'll do is we will fight this other monster kind of thing. It's not too difficult, um, we'll just have to cast a spell on it, and that will... Or not dispel, sorry, we'll have to ca uh, cast reflect on it, because it will heal itself a ton, and uh, the only way to defeat it is to have it use, well, you can defeat it other ways, but that's just a really easy way to defeat it, to use reflect, so that we don't have to, actually, I'm going to keep Lulu in the party, uh, just to poison Seymour. Yeah, to use reflect is going to be great, um, because uh, it won't be able to heal itself. We're going to go all the way here, and... Now we'll have a little cutscene where we talk to Seymour. Xanarkand. And this actually shouldn't be that difficult of a fight. Um, because we have our Aeons leveled up, and we also have a new Aeon, which is pretty powerful too. So. Me neither. What are we gonna We'll do something. So the very first thing that I'm gonna do until we do is um, Let's go to Xanarkand. Cast we'll haste to go. There. And when we start our It'll fight, all come together. we're going to talk I with Seymour, it. and he's going to say something pretty tragic, I guess, Yay. about the Ronsos. Just a second. Hmm? Um, just now Riku's going to find you sounded like a leader, you Seymour, know? actually. And she'll sort of freak Star out, of but... Uh? Yeah, she's going to freak out right now. Huh? I think they should have sent Seymour, like, after they defeated him the last time. <laughs> uh. Like they just uh, Son of Jack. haven't really Riku. realized. Or I mean, like that he just keeps you coming back. Fighting. Just go, go. <laughs> now is your time to. Not if. Save some. <laughs> That's great. Like. Uh, Lady running Yuna, pull from uh, Kimari <laughs> and Waka there. Yuna. A sin. Allow me to say something to <laughs> Yours was truly a gallant race. They threw themselves at me to bar my path. One after another. <laughs> no. Kimari. You could end the suffering of this poor Ronso. I don't understand you. Allow Kimari to die and release him from his pain. Spira is a land of suffering and sorrow caught in a spiral of death. To destroy, to heal Spira. I will become sin. Yes, with your help. Come with me, Yuna. 
once I have become the next Sin, your father will be freed again. Ah, uh, uh, uh. uh, what do you know? Pitiful mortal. Your hope! I just wanted to um, have her leave the field um, because she's very vulnerable. And then I'm going to use haste on Q as well. I'm going to switch more on to Yuna. I'll just have her start summoning. I don't know. I guess we can use the grand summon on the Jimbo. Pay him like uh, five thousand. See if he uses his overdrive. That really didn't do that much, but. Uh. Death. change to Oron, just because he is the best defense out of any of them. And I'm going to just summon again. I believe Bahamut 
or one of these guys should defeat um, either this one or the next one. I will defeat this one. His overdrive. Then we'll use Yuna's. Uh, oh crap! I used the wrong one. She was the one that doesn't have the overdrive. It's all right though. She'll uh, go and for damage. She might even defeat him. Um, because I don't think. He, I, I guess he has a little bit of. for paint pack. <laughs> so I'm gonna actually just use um One thing that d removes half of the enemy's health. Oh, that sucks. Um, we'll use this Aeon, and then we'll use Ifrit at the uh, So I'm just gonna do. I'm just gonna use like a uh, mega potion, just so that we heal everyone. Okay. We'll summon. <clears throat> Sorry, we'll summon Ifrit. That really wasn't that difficult. There was one part where, like, it was a little bit worrisome, and that was right before, or right after you used that little lance attack because it deals 2,000 damage. Um, I was kind of thinking we might have not survived that because we didn't have Orin on the field. That's why it's always nice to have Orin on the field. Um, but, I mean, in not too far, we'll also have the auto life ability unlocked, and we'll have Yuna start using that. And we got another level 4 key sphere, which is great. He will become sin with lies. If he becomes, we're leaving. You know, so <laughs> that's great. Sins, my old man. You hit your head. Sin is my old man. My old man became Sin. I don't know how or why he did it. I felt him inside. 
And when I did, I knew it was true. My old man's spear is suffering. Sorry. Even... knowing that Sin is your father... Still, you know I must. I know. Let's get him. I think my old man would want that. You'd fight your own... Yeah, no problem there. Huh. Uh, but you sure this ain't some kind of... Then... Uh, I, uh... I'm getting a little confused. Why? We'll learn what... It's crazy, everyone, it looks like, or, not everyone, but, Waka, Lulu, and Riku have, like, no help in that battle. Using these faith, someone is drawing energy from all of them. This many? Who wields power on this scale? Hey, you know something. Look not to others for knowledge. The you need my dad. No. Huh? This is our. What? And now he is sort of back in Xanarkin. Um... We're gonna talk to the, pretty much the, uh, Amit Faith. Remember me? We met in Bavel. Uh, but that wasn't the first time we met. I've known about you for a long time. I... I... Where are we? <laughs> Silly, don't recognize your own home? What's gotten into you? Wait. Wait. Precisely. A dream? A dream? Are, Are you, you crazy? crazy? I don't, I don't have, have time to be dreaming, dreaming now. now. You're, you're wrong. wrong. It's, it's not, not that, that you're, you're dreaming. dreaming. You are a dream. Huh? Wait, Wait a, a sec. sec. There was a war. 
Yeah, with Machina, right? Yes, a war between Xanarkand and Bavel. Bavel's Machina assured their victory from the start. Spira had never seen such power. The summoners of Xanarkand didn't stand a chance. Xanarkand was doomed to oblivion. That's why we tried to save it, if only in a memory. What did you do? The remaining summoners and the townspeople that survived the war, they all became Faith, Faith for the Summoning. The Summoning? You mean Sin? No, I mean this place. A Xanarkand that never sleeps. Oh, what? The dreams of the Faith summoned the memories of the city. They summoned all the buildings, all the people who lived there. The people? What? They're all dreams? Me? Too? Yes, you're a dream of the faith. You, your father, your mother, everyone. All dreams. And if the faith stopped dreaming... No. no! So, so what, what if I'm a dream? dream? I... I... I like being here. here. We've, We've been, been dreaming, dreaming so long. long. We're, We're tired. tired. Would you and your father... Would you let us rest? Both you and your father have been touched by sin. Dreamy is Siri, resting. The one around him, all Spira, <laughs> the spiral revolves. What are you saying? You two are more. Wake up! Wait. Just a little more. Maybe you are the dream that will end up. You okay? I... I'm okay. What happened? Nothing. I blacked out. I was dreaming. <laughs> you called me. And I woke up. <sighs> Nothing like a good nap. Well, I'm ready. Let's go. Actually, um, oh wait, I guess it's not here, because Yuna does drop her, uh, little thing that she has on the, uh, the sphere thing, and Titus picks it up. This is actually a really easy uh, fight, and the way that we'll defeat it is we'll actually just use a combo break. Um, I'm just gonna use shell on everyone. So we use armor break.
so now we're pretty much dealing the normal amount of damage.
you can see how much a normal attack would do right now when we use it for the first time. We can only use like 175, which would take forever <laughs> to, to actually defeat this. Wow! Opponent. So we're gonna. Is that um, edible? So we used armor break, and now we'll do about 2,000 damage every single time when we attack it. Just use a uh, I guess I'll use a mega potion. Actually, go back and re heal everyone. What next? This might help your complexion.
I think we'll actually just end it right here. Um, just because it's a good place to stop. And it looks like we're able to... It shouldn't... Like, some of these monsters are a little bit difficult, but they're not, like, crazy tough. The good thing is that we're able to deal damage to all of them. So, that's really nice. But, um, pretty much after this, uh, we'll have a couple more fights, and then um, we'll be able to get Unicelestra up we'll have to fight this monster after the cave for a boss fight, and then we'll have to fight Unaluska. Um, and then we'll... At one, we have a, another boss fight at the Xanarkin Temple, and then we'll get Unicelestra up and, and uh, all the remaining Aeons. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope you have a great rest of your day.